start streaming. Shoot. Okay, there we go. All right, let me see if it's working on the other end. Uh, Alright guys, uh, Politics Gaming here along with Backstar. Um, he's actually, his mic is actually muted. Um, so let me, I'm kind of waiting for people to come in up. There you go, Wildest Gamer's in here. Um, what is going on, Wildest Gamer? Well, I'm only making $128 million off of my value-added tax. Famous artist. Number of followers, oh god. If you got Wendy's in your town, show some love. Wow. Right. Uh, Backstar, can you even hear me? Our team is in place. The information gathered on this. All right. You should probably, if you're watching my uh, live stream, you should probably uh, mute the. The national defense does not does not have enough men to fulfill its missions. All right, let's go ahead and shoot for some thirty-five thousand because we need troops. I should actually. I just signed a contract with the United States. No, it's kind of unrealistic to do that, but national defense and employment issuance of one point one three one billion dollars of debt. Youch. Um. Alright. Yo. Hey, what's going on, dude? I just got done eating some fries, and I'm uh. Up making my projections for the 2018 midterm yeah um, I actually I actually haven't even announced this um, on my channel but yeah um, I am actually everyone everyone who's watching right now me and Baxter are actually going to be collaborating in order to um, we have obtained some information me and Baxter are basically going to be collaborating basically to predict Future elections, we can actually cover American elections, which is going to be our primary focus. And um, we are going to cover maybe even other country elections, um, such as maybe Turkey, you know, Belgium, stuff like that. Is there elections in Brazil in October? I don't know. Uh, I remember reading that somewhere. I'm about to look that up. Let's look at my growth rate. Negative five percent growth rate. Well, you are in a big recession, my friend. Start selling. It's not even oil. a recession. It's just horrible. Oh my God! Look at my GDP. Sell oil. I don't even think I can actually sell oil. Does Syria even produce oil? Is the question. I built some oil wells. This is what you should do. 
and wait, Vady Rock. I have wait, 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 wait. I have natural gas and I have no oil. Nobody, nobody wants that. It's all about the oil. So Vady Rock, call it a day. I I don't have the money to. I don't have the money or the equipment to invade a rock. Unemployment stagnating around 28%. I have like a... Let me look. $2.5 billion um, contract with the United States. I'm going to go ahead and sell them some natural gas as well. Uh, let's go to natural gas. Got two million so that's six hundred and eighty six million dollars. So can I just say I'm currently on Rick Scott or excuse me, landing dot Rick Scott for Florida dot com is Rick Scott's Senate campaign site and I'm watching his video. Mm-hmm. First off, who stands with their hands on their hips? Both hands on their hips. Like who does that? me but you're standing in front of a camp like i don't know don't judge people in politics everyone judges you in politics well it looks like i don't see i really see a difference with uh my power and revolution with my new graphics card what graphics card you get uh gtx uh 10 and 1060. Oh, I got a um, 970. I just signed a s contract with the United States again. Why? Good you should Lord. Be trading in Russia. Well, I can get the highest price off the United States. Oh, would you sell them or you buy something? Selling. Let me watch this campaign ad right quick. All right, I'm going to increase my troop numbers to 45,000. I'm waiting for my growth to hit. Because... I think my <laughs> What's your inflation? Forty five percent. Wait, no, it's going down forty one percent. Raise Peak. taxes. I, I I'm barely making anything off of taxes at the moment. Because your currency's worth crap. Mm-hmm. So I need to concentrate on do it well, this gamer said. He said, build a pipeline and a port. With 13% deficit? Jesus Christ. Let me just say about this one minute, 32 second video. If I was in Florida, I would be voting for Rick Scott right now. I know. And I'm a registered Democrat. But, PG, what do you think about all this? I mean, this is going to be a close election down there in Florida. Um, swear to God, if I, no, nah, I'm going to hold off on the port right now. What's the point of building a port? Just build a pipeline or something. <laughs> what the hell is a pipeline going to do? I don't know. Create jobs. Yeah, it can create jobs, but temporarily. I'm waiting for my growth to spike so I can all right, I quelled that rebellion and You mean Damascus. democratic protest? Democratic protest? No, that wasn't. Alright, I have fourteen percent approval. Do something uh, so more money taxes I'm taxes I'm gonna have to wait on. Total income is actually going up since uh Oh, that's since January, but it's kind of been slightly going up. Um, I'm going to have to just let my inflation just start going down. You need to... I would invest in health and education. 
Not yet. If you want your popu- if if I you want, want your popularity to go up. Yeah, my popularity, but like I have a thirteen point three percent um deficit right now. I need to here I'll spend sixty seven million dollars on some hospitals. Let's see what that does. Yeah. Half a percent in approval, but approval's up to sixteen percent. Uh, I mean, as soon as like I get like maybe like a five six percent deficit, I would start investing the hell out of uh, healthcare. But this inflation just needs to keep going down. Here. I'll increase my interest rate to 20%. That's going to cost me $159 million. Put my interest rate to the max. And... But my inflation's really starting to plummet. My growth rate, four and a half percent. It's going up a little bit. Strong suspicion that we have strong suspicions that this ter- this pl- these people are about to carry out a attack. Ooh, we borrowed a large quantity of nails. Let's go ahead and arrest him. For so borrowing nails. We have strong suspicions that he bought the... nails. How do you know he's not building a house? Nigga, I don't know. Talk to his brother about suicide. I tried to arrest the dude, and he's the one who's about to commit the attack. You found absolute. I'm just looking at total jihad. Hey, what's going side. on, James? Okay, so proceed with another arrest. Released? Oh my god, he's the only dude that we can really do. And he seems like well, he the guy's about to do it. Anything. And I just lost four and a half percent in approval because of a terrorist attack that killed three hundred and thirty five people. But didn't you try that I swear that that's just Oh man, my approval's at five percent now. Play France now. It was a gas attack. You're already getting the invit the invitation to travel. Just go ahead and accept. Nope. I avoided this once, I'm gonna avoid it again. Wow. Just do what Jack said. A truck. But there's no challenge if you use your cheats. Boy, you're playing a screwed up country to start with. Yeah, I know, but that's the challenge. To turn to make Syrian economy modern? Literally near impossible to even get approval when you're trying to change these Middle Eastern nations. I'm not even trying to change anything. It's just that I keep coming under terrorist attack. Well, aren't you at war with a terror organization? No, I won. PG, while you're trying to get your approval rating up. And um, there we go. What, it came up? No, it went down. To what? 6%. Yeah, just go ahead and play France. Call it a night. What am I going to be doing as France? Uh, Fixing the French economy, modernizing it, like Macron's trying to do. I wish there was a button on here where you could actually just, instead of a dialogue box coming up, where you could literally just um, resign. Mm-hmm. 
This year is called Hit Escape. And then it's uh, at the bottom of the screen, it says something called Save and Quit. You All click right. that, you know. Let's see what happens whenever I give $44 million a teacher, teacher training. Oh, uh, your economy is going to yep. go in. Oh, wait. My approval went up. Oh, you just invested in education. So invest in health. Do classes for the gifted. Wow. Yeah, but you are going more and more debt. Yeah, exactly. Why do you think I was trying to avoid it in the first place? But do you want to get kicked out of office? Invite I mean, in, invite Jack to the to the call. What? I said invite Jack to the call. I don't know if I can how do I do that? User settings. Here, I'll do it. Oh, I got it. You got it? Yo. What's up? He just got to an answer to the call. <laughs> Hell yeah, let's have a Syrian space program. <laughs> oh my god, look how much it costs to invest into this. 102000 Okay, this is weird because I can hear like. How was my favorite Lib Dim? What? Oh my god! Get off my live stream, dude. Okay, I'm off your live stream. <laughs> <laughs> now, did you see? Uh, did you see um, what I did? My, what my approvals at now? Yeah, that's good. Full so, Jack. Why are you not a Lib Dem? Because I'm not. You know what Lib Dems hug? Gays, I don't know. European. <laughs> anyway, um. <clears throat> excuse me. I invested in a port. Why? I don't know. Someone told me to invest in a port. Can I cancel the construction? Yeah, you can. No, I can't. Shit. You can't cancel the, con the construction? The budget deficit. Oh, there's my budget deficit warning. Go ahead and just play as France. To piss off Jack. No, come on. How about, how about, how about I do a UK roleplay and make them fascists? Like <laughs> Why don't you play the UK and try to get them back in the EU? No. What? And there we go. You got kicked out of office? Yep. Went into exile in Belarus. Wait, why in Belarus? <laughs> what? Because uh, no one else. That the place. Surely you'd be in Turkey. Oh, well, yeah. Just play, just play France. I mean, that's more of a. Ch if you want a challenge, play France. That's cool. You can go in exile. That's cool. You didn't know that? No. Come on. I don't play this game as much anymore. What should I play? France. I don't know. Congo. <laughs> no, don't play an African. Don't play an. You know, you notice racist. how you notice how the the three D models of uh, Bashar al Assad and uh, Emmanuel Macron kind of look the same. Good hang day. on, hang on, hang on. Look, look at my live stream. I'm about to show it. Yeah, I'm looking at it. Just check it out real quick. <laughs> this is hilarious. So, so I'm gonna talk you through what to do. PG, hang on, okay? hang on, real quick. Oh, Jack, did you uh, did you hear me about what uh, I upgraded to? No. Got a, G got a fucking... GTX 1060. Oh, yes. What do you got? 1070. Am I the only one here with the cheap freaking crap? I got a 970. Oh, that's, that's not that bad. You got a what? Most, most people got. I know. I know. Some people got a Whoa, my lag. Yeah, I know. Some people have terrible computers. Yeah, oh, let's look they at have, this. They have toasters. Okay, so let's look at the economic situation in France. Yeah, I can't really do anything right now. My <clears throat> thing is lagging like hell. Uh, do you have your porn open? Oh, okay, there we go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude, I do. Okay, so wait. L look, look, look how similar they look. 
Oh, wait, it's not open yet on the stream. I can't see anything. It's laggy as hell. It's about to show up. They look like twin Yo, brothers. Yeah, they, they look, look the exactly alike. Oh my it's god, like, dude. Macron's so pale. Well, Macron's like, what, 39 years old? I don't know. French people are pale. I, I don't know. All right. <laughs> Okay, so let's talk. Let's look at the economic situation of France. I France should actually TV. have a France gameplay. Because uh, you show me the health sector, please, my friend. $613 billion in the Social Security. Okay, well, let me hold on. It's a, little, it's a little bit of a delay. And an additional uh, so $30 billion dollars do, in the health. If it, okay, so what you want to do actually go in the health tab and give you a little bit of pointers because I've All played right. France millions of times. Millions wow, of times. their health sector is nearly fully funded. Yeah, they f they spend a lot in health, which is one reason why they're in so much debt right now. <laughs> look at look at Cuba, the sixty two percent of their GDP of their GDP is being spent on uh on health care. <laughs> So what you want to do is reimburse for uh, doctor visits, reimburse for hospital treatment. You want to cut that one star. Both of them. Yep. Or you can do one one at a time. You can do one in January and then wait a quarter and then do another one. But you got to build the hospitals. Oh yeah, I do. I used to do that, and in 2018, it they kind of they kind of fixed that. But um, I wouldn't cut both of them at the same time. Yeah, I used to cut both of them at the same time, but hold on, my ex girlfriend is texting me right now. Why even text her if she's your ex? Because we're friends. <laughs> now, so what is your like debt? Are you in debt? Of course, every country so in this game is in debt. No, not necessarily. I think um, um, public debt ninety six percent of the GDP. Jesus freaking Christ! That's worse than the U.S. Um, the most I owe to is the United Kingdom. <laughs> what? The sec. The sec I'm, I'm I owe I owe six hundred and forty three billion to the United Kingdom, five hundred twenty one billion to Japan, and four hundred twenty nine billion to I the would United do. States. I would I would leave the eurozone. And just go it, just you know, get your economy in a surplus and inflation right, and then rejoin because your inflation is just going to skyrocket. That that should I leave it up to your referendum? You first need to get at least ninety percent approval rating before you can do something like that. Yeah. So you gotta, I don't, you gotta do your your magic or just use God and Spy to get it through, which is typically what I do. But anyway, Jack, was, I heard some 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 horrible things over there in in, in the UK. Well, I'm hearing well, about a uh, possibility of nationalizing. Excuse me. Uh, yeah, nationalizing whoa. the rail service. That's not Holy shit! Oh, what's my uh, unemployment rate? It's, it's probably like nine percent. Let me look. Uh, nine point six. Wow. Um, yeah. I am just built roads. Now I'm fully speed. funding uh help for employing young people, and then. But you need to cut employment agency then. Oh yeah, cut cut cutting employment cut agency. Hmm? Cutting health will fix everything, trust me. Yeah, cutting health. Yeah, but... That's li that's literally like that Brazilian kid on the other server telling me to reduce uh, or to increase the retirement age. You also need to increase taxes, preferably on the VAT and income tax. That will and... get inflation down. So that's well, inflate. I mean, if he starts doing trade deals, which I hope he does. I just increase oh. the uh, pension. No. Well, yeah, you can do that. You get popularity, yeah, yeah. But you have you got to increase taxes. Uh -huh. 
Okay, I'm gonna cancel that large fortunes bill that I had. See how much approval I get off of that. 2.1. You have. So for the VAT, I would increase it like from 20% to 20.5%. Yeah, not that much of an increase. Yeah. And also build internet services, you know, for, you know. I don't know, I just put 15% of, the, of the nation under fiber optic. That would definitely get you approved right now. So, y'all know we still have the U.S. government role play, right? I'm I, I I'm barely active in that. Honestly, I really, it's it's not as good as the United Kingdom. It's not as good because it's not as organized. I mean, it's not as organized, and I really, I honestly, really don't like it right I, now. I'm, I'm actually running for president. Yeah, I saw. I I was I was almost I almost kind of thought about a. Yeah, Egypt actually sounds like a good a uh, good thing the world to play on here too. Um, oh, also rig the French also rig the Russian elections. They have elections. Rig them. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. Hang on, Secret Service. But yeah, like I'm running for president, and I'm currently Iowa, New Hampshire, and South Carolina primaries are tomorrow. I'm currently. Oh. Can't do it until like the, the mid middle of February. I'm leading in Iowa. I'm leading in New Hampshire. Leading in Nevada. Don't do that. Da, da, do copy da, da, copyright. Copyright. Da, da, oh, yeah, da, da. <laughs> play Macron. Matter of fact, play Macron's song. So I'm not playing, playing anything. Song. Why? Just play 30 seconds of it. No, nah, nothing will leave. I just need to invest in a cyber security. You just need to talk about Florida. What? What are you talking about? The Senate race, you dingbat. Wait, what? Florida has a Senate race? The yes, governor of Florida, Rick, Rick Scott, uh, is he running looks for... looks like an alien. Yeah, it kind of does. That... The governor of Florida, um, who is... Rick Scott. Yeah, he was a... Uh... Oh my god, it's scary. Exactly. And he's wearing a Navy hat. The like. Parkland shooting happened under his watch. He's running for the U.S. federal government. No, I think he's going to lose. He's going to lose. I mean, hold hold on now. Rick Scott is pretty popular. Oh, let me hold on. What's his oh, approval he, rating? Hold on. Let me let me let me back that up because I I did read somewhere his approval rating was over fifty percent. Hope you don't hear the Snapchat. I do. Let's do some housing. Oh no. Does a okay? I have sixty eight percent approval. I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave the euro now. I will get it to seventy just to be sure. And oh, whoa! To bother. What? Holy shit! Push it through Parliament. I I went through Parliament. <laughs> I'm gonna have to cancel that bill. I mean, you could try and talk to those your party and get. No, get there's no look at look at the number. Look at look at my live stream right now. Oh shit! Yeah, you may want to do a referendum. I just look at this because his mom was delayed. Oh my god, there was a terrorist attack. Oh wow, eighty-nine. No. Oh, seventy-seven percent again. There was a terrorist attack in Amins. What a surprise! Uh, five people are dead. It was an attack on a police station. Wow. And he was known by my secret services. So why didn't you do uh, something? That was under your watch. <laughs> it was you under my what? watch. You're fired. Hey. I'm talking about... uh, don't make me <laughs> cyber attack Syria. <laughs> do it. <laughs> no, please. <laughs> it's my home. I really want to figure out if uh, military cyber attacks actually do any good. <laughs> military cyber attacks, only thing it does... It's actually pretty useful if you're at war with them, if, with the country. 
But it'll basically just freeze the nation's entire army, and you can just swoop in and take the capital. That's pretty much my strategy. Oh, look at this. The 10% loss of productivity because of a uh, internet. Oh my god, they got the first polls for the Senate race. What is it? Um, According to CBS, it says that Rick Scott... We now Wait. So Nelson is at, at 46%. Myself. Nelson's at 46% and Rick Scott is at 42%. Uh, Nelson holds the leads with independent voters, which is very crucial in Florida. Oh, look at this. The Washington Post is saying why Florida's Senate race may be the biggest referendum on Trump in 2018. Seriously? They keep calling it that. A well, referendum on Trump. Like, I, what did they say this? I've never heard of that. Every referendum against your plus. <laughs> You know, you know, as a Democrat, I am freaking sick and tired of these people crying about Trump. Like, look, in 2020, put somebody who's smart. Actually, like, actually, um, Rick Scott. Here's our latest. Season. I think he's going to run for president. That's that. that oh, no, 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 no. Rick Scott, um, running actually really shook up the Florida race because apparently it was going to be all in favor of the uh, the CNN Bill was Nelson. calling it yeah it was CNN was saying that it was uh, leaning toward Bill Nelson and the Democrats um, but Rick Scott running for that position actually really shook it up so Florida is now a toss up so yeah, Florida o Florida along with West Virginia Indiana Missouri North Dakota Indiana Nevada oh. and Arizona are all toss up states in the uh, um so, in the senate race texas actually texas is leaning texas. leaning republican not likely or solid so, republican with all that being said i got 270 win my guys if you want to keep up you want to make your own predictions go to 270 to win.com but with all those states nevada north dakota, north dakota indiana west virginia florida the yeah. democrats where are you looking up your uh, polling from? Um, I'll send you a link from CBS. Yeah, I'm trying to figure yeah. out. Um, oh, here's some polling from the Texas race. Screw Ted Cruz. Ted Cruz. Ted Cruz. Ted Cruz. Um, I want Marco. Public policy po polling is is uh this was in January of 2018. Forty five. 45% for Ted Cruz and 37% for Beto O'Rourke. Yes. It's safe. Republican. <laughs> yes. Jack, Cruz. Jack, are you trying to say that Texas should become blue? No. But anyway, well, as I was saying, with all, with those, what? One, two, three, four, mm -hmm. five states toss-ups, all of them Democratic. Oh my God, listen, to, God. listen to this. Um... My one of my subscribers, uh, Super Smashy, he said attacking amends, attacking amends, or however you say it. Police are unsure to, unsure about Ahmed Ali Muhammad Ali Afiz's motive. Well, well, what was motive? Send him the G bank. Wait, how much did this terrorist? Oh my God, the terrorist attack cost costed twenty three million. You know how much the ones in Syria costed me while I was playing Syria. How much? Like less than a million. Well, that's because you don't have any police. That's because that's because been, no, that's because like there's flattened. no. Yeah, that's because like where's Syria the, is like a the, freaking farm field now. Where's a Ale Where's Aleppo? What is Aleppo? Yeah, what is Aleppo? What is Jill Stein? But anyway, <laughs> um, basically. The Republicans still have 50 seats with all these toss-ups. No. So the Democrats, in order to win, also, also Missouri, also Missouri is pretty toss-up. So. Ugh, why is my OBS acting so weird? I don't know, but my projection, my prediction is. <laughs> Uh, whatever, I gotta... Is that a backslide loses the presidency? 